git agenda team the topics so what are the topics we are going to cover in git team one is first one is okay introduction team second one is what is vcs and types of vcst what is the vcs and types of vcs vcs means version control system version control system team vcs now third one is how to get software installation team get software installation team fourth one team fourth one get project structure fifth one team get architecture sixth one team git commands or operations almost how many git commands we are going to see one is one is git help next one is git config git init next one git config git pull yeah yeah okay i will come in order d git add git status order order means how how we can execute this one git rm git restore eighth one git commit git log git clone git push git pull git branch git checkout Fifteenth team, Git fetch, Git stash, Git merge, Git rebase, Git diff, Git revert. git move git show git revert git remote these are the most of the git commands we are going into c team for our project okay each and every command will show you practically team. each and every command will show you practically and how it works then we'll explain to you now what about it commands execution team there are two ways we can execute this git commands one is using using command line other one is using ids like eclipse comma spring tool shoot comma intellij ids team next one team it it have account creation in public account B private repo I 
ఐదు డాట్ గిట్ ఫోల్డర్ స్ట్రక్చర్ ట్వంటీ గిట్ బ్రాంచింగ్ స్ట్రాటజీ గిట్ బ్రాంచింగ్ స్ట్రాటజీ ఇన్ రియల్ టైమ్ వీ విల్ హ్యావ్ డిఫరెంట్ బ్రాంచింగ్ స్ట్రాటజీస్ ఆర్ దేర్ ఇన్ అవర్ రియల్ టైమ్ వన్ ఈస్ దెర్ ఆర్ so many branching strategies are there one is development branch another one is master branch another one is release branch another one is hard fix branch another one is fork branch there are different types of branches are there for in git repo these are called branching strategy how to work this branching strategy and all we should see it next immediately how the pr process how the code reviews how the code merge next one thing real time problems git and how to fix them okay now faqs last one is summary done team this is my complete code team any doubts team please ask about the course sir will you cover gitlab also no only github will cover if it is github will cover gitlab big uh, big basket all are same okay okay, okay sir thank you no query uh, like which one uh, mostly used in the real time like gitlab or github no github bar bit bucket gitlab gitlab no gitlab yeah. when compared to github gitlab will be very less use using github only will be high use oh, okay so thank you yeah. any question steve no sir okay. please continue for me yeah yeah okay team introduction team introduction team now git is a popular version control system team what is popular version control system i will explain to you git is a popular version control system in the bracket it is also called vcs vcs it was created by it was created by linus torvalds in 2005 and has been has been maintained by and has been maintained by junio junio amano Next one, it is used for it is okay, used for team. It is used for number one, okay, okay. tracking code changes okay tracking code changes b tracking who made changes like history history of the files 
sí. Coding. Collaboration. Okay. Coding. Collaboration team. No, C team. So, what is mean by okay, version controlling of system team? Okay, simple team. See, now here, what is the main use of this Git team? See, I have a project team. I have a project. See, in this project, in this project team, in this project, there are so many models are there. Have a project in this project so many models are there team. each model will have will have some files are there team. module 1 module 2 each model will have so many files are there team. so now now here what happened so every developer okay every developer see so okay, every developer see okay please try to understand in real time what happened this module one will be handled by one developers or module two will be handled by one developers team Another developer. Okay. Model 3 will be handled by other developer team. Like that, we have n number of okay, developers are there. Team. Developer 1, developer 2, developer 3. Team. See, now here what happened? Our client will provide the okay, requirements team. Client will provide the requirements according to the requirements. According to the requirements, developers will develop the code. Develop the code D. Now very 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 important topic team developers are to develop the code in your real time so where the developer will store the code developers will not store the code into local system client will tell hey you should not you should not move your code into your local system because you have written 500 lines of the code today tomorrow somehow your system will be corrupted or somehow your system will be issue then what happened 500 lines of code will be gone team so developer should not store the code into local system always Developers should move the code, move the code into remote server, remote servers where the, where the, move the code into remote server, where the, where all the code, where all the code can be where all the source code can be placed where all the source code can be placed in, in secure manner in secure manner in secure way in okay, secure manner okay team Please try to understand team. So, 
client will tell developer will not store the code into local system due to some security issues due to some security issues developer will not co will not place the will not place or will not store into local system you should place into your okay your code into the remote system see every day every day now here what happened every day developer should modify the code right every day developer should modify the code right according to the requirements so so now here now here what happened so if modify the code that means every day new new version of the files will be stored be new version means what day one day one file one version 1.0 some, some code changes a2 file 2 version 1.1 some code changes a3 version 1.1 and 1.2 some code changes team like that we are storing all the code into a in our local so it is called version controlling system team same file team same file we are adding everyday changes the moment keep on you are adding changes the file version will be the file the file version will be changed team the file version will be changed team now here see what is mean by version controlling system team vcs what is mean by version controlling system vcs vcs is a is a system vcs is a system that that records changes to a file vcs is a system that records changes to a files or changes to a file or set of files team changes to a file or set of files team vcs is a system okay that records changes to a file set of files over time over time team okay so that we can recall we can recall specific version later okay we can recall specific version later team okay later team that means so that means now here that is so for every for every file change for every okay source code changes for every source code changes for every source code changes in a file for every source code changes in a file team okay a new version a new version will be created a new version will be created team a new version will be created team okay understand team now see there are there are three types of vcs 
there are three types of vcs vcs urgent control systems are there one is local version control system local vcs in the bracket lvcs you connect to one team centralized control system team it is called c vcs c vcs centralized version control system d team of here what is called d here distributed version control system distributed version control system team this is called d vcs d vcs okay team there are three types of okay version control system team to maintain the file systems okay now first one team what is first one first one will go for local version control system team this try to understand me local version control system team this basic team very very important team basic team and very very important team what is local version of a system team it is your local computer team local computer here it is a version database version database now it is a version 1 now if any one file is there that file version 1 file version 2 same file version 3 okay now version 1 now version 2 version 3 okay now if you have a file please try to understand team basics are important before you go for your game now here what happened you are writing the code and you know you are moving the code now first it was now here version one team after some changes would be happen version 2 after some changes will be happen version 3 okay now here what happened team it is your local system team maybe d directory or okay d r e directories it is your local system team d r e okay, directories team c team Now what is the problem with this? Now here, now what is the problem with this? Drawback of this, it is, it is used to maintain the, maintain the file versions and retrieve the, retrieve the files based on specific version. Retrieve the files based on specific versions team now see now good team now here what are the drawbacks with this approach underline it is it is local stream number one if our system will be corrupted 
then there may be loss data there might be data loss issues there might be data loss issues if our system will be corrupted team then there may be there might be the data there might be data will be there might be data loss issues team okay number two team number two it is easy to forget easy to forget forget which directory which directory you are and you know which directory you are in and some accidentally write the data data to the wrong file wrong file or copy the other files or copy the other files team see if it is in local so many issues would be happening team so many issues would be happening by by mistake we can delete those files by mistake we can delete those files to overcome these problems industry has used for instead of keeping all the files source code files into your local they introduced a concept is called centralized logging team they introduced a concept is called okay centralized control system centralized version control system team okay version control system team got it team please try to understand now what is this so okay centralized version control team now here see so now here see people can so this is called of some work centralized version means now here developers developers can collaborate you can collaborate developers can collaborate and do the changes team do the changes team okay now some of the example of this cc now here some of the examples of the example of this cvcs team centralized version control okay system stream some of the examples are this means cvs subversion subversion okay, next one team perforce all are okay, examples team all are okay, examples team okay now okay next one team please try to understand team okay next one it is a centralized server cv cs is a is a is a centralized version server okay will have will have will have single server that contains that contains all the version to file single server that contains all the version file team now now we'll see how this okay, centralized okay, version control more number of clients can connect to centralized version control system and check out our 
files. Okay, so we check out our client team for many years. This has been this has been the standard version control. Now here see, see how it is there. This is the okay centralized version control system team. Let us see how many clients are there. Working copy one, working copy two, okay, working copy three team. How many okay remote servers are there? Only centralized version version control system is there only centralized okay, version control system is there and uh, <coughs> team hope you're clear team now see here so here developers don't keep the code in the local team developers don't keep the code in the local team please try to understand don't keep your code in the local every day whatever code you are writing you should keep your code into your centralized okay, version control system team don't keep your code into your local team every day you should keep your code into okay remote server team if any okay, developer will do some changes team so okay everyone knows team okay everyone knows here okay see what are the advantages of with this um, okay approach over local version control team okay everyone knows to certain degree of what everyone else on the project doing team what everyone is okay else on the project doing team so here advantage here number one team okay, everyone knows everyone knows team okay, okay everyone knows to a certain degree certain degree what what okay, everyone else everyone else on the project is doing the project is doing team the project is doing team okay now it is easier to look administrator administrator now okay who is the administrator team who will maintain this repository sorry who is the administrator team who is maintain this repository okay, that guy is called administrator team administrator have full control team administrator will have full control over over who can do what and easier and easier to and easier to and, and easier to manage and easier to manage team now what are the drawbacks team very very important See, what are the drawbacks now okay number one are the drawbacks first to 10 minutes maybe you know getting bore team after that you will get good or interested topic team please okay, try to understand if you are interested topic is a git first to drawback team it is a single point of failure spf that means single point of failure that centralized version control system server that okay centralized server server represents team single point of failure that centralized server okay represents team that means if the server goes down server goes down for an hour then during that hour during that, that, that hour nobody can collaborate nobody can 
collaborate at all or save or save version changes to the server okay so okay next one thing if 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 the hard disk of the okay, centralized server if the hard disk of the okay so centralized servers will be corrupted will be corrupted and proper backups haven't been kept haven't been kept in then then we will lose the data then we will launch the data team. we will launch the data of everything we will lose everything we will we will lose the source code entire history of the project okay okay except okay except okay except recent files okay everything will be collapsed in local system also will be okay support of okay, the same problem okay local local version control system also will be suffer same problem also suffer same problem note here that is so now here that is whenever whenever you have the whenever you have the you have on entire entire okay you have an entire Okay, history, okay, entire history of the project, entire history of the project in a single place. Okay, your risk team, your risk losing everything, everything. Now here what happened, you know, it is our centralized of the version control system team. If this one will be loss or, you know, down or something corrupted happen it will be impacting for all this it will be impacting for everything team okay nothing is there okay important point is here note note in centralized version control system always developers will get the latest code will get the latest code from the server not complete history of the source code always will get the latest code in in centralized version okay in centralized control you know centralized okay, version control system always developers will get the latest code Always, okay, developers will get the latest code from the server. Not complete okay, history of the source code. Now here, whenever this will be gone, what happened? You don't have any old okay, history of the code. You have latest code. Latest code, what can we do? Latest code may work, may not work. So, whenever this, this single point of is down, here you haven't to keep any your backup code also team it is impacting for all team to overcome these problems that means industry was struggling note one industry was okay, struggling with svn this is the this is the major drawback major drawbacks with the svn svn team okay okay svn is the one of the okay svn is the one of the okay cvs and okay svn okay, subversion is the one of the okay, centralized okay version control system team to overcome these problems industry slowly moved into what 
डिस्ट्रीब्यूटेड वर्षन कंट्रोल सिस्टम भी डिस्ट्रीब्यूटेड वर्षन कंट्रोल ओके सिस्टम भी नो हियर डिस्ट्रीब्यूटेड वर्षन कंट्रोल ओके सिस्टम्स आर गिट मर्क्यूरियल टॉक्स बाजार अंशान व्हाट दिस ओके डिस्ट्रीब्यूटेड वो वर्षन कंट्रोल विल डू सीरी Please try to understand. It is a distributed. It is a repository. Every developer. It is a developer system. How the Git structure? Developer one. Developer two. Now okay, developer three. Now here what happened? C team, please try to understand. C team, first these are the clients. They will not get the latest to code of the latest to code from distributed version control system. They will get fully mirror of the repository, okay, including fully history. Even two three years in back, what code has been committed by the developers? Everything code will be bring into here team. See first advantage here. What is the first advantage? Please try to understand it. Please try to understand. Clients, developers, don't check code the latest snapshot. Of the files, clients or developers don't check out the latest snapshot of the files, latest to code of the files. Rather than, rather, they fully, fully mirror the, mirror the okay, repository includes, includes. Includes history of the okay, including okay, includes so they will mirror the okay, repository okay, including mirror the okay, repository okay, including it's a fully history okay, including it's a fully of history team. Next one. If server will dies, if server will dies, then these systems, these systems were restored, restored because 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 every clone is because every clone is. Because every clone is or every copy is, every copy is a, every copy is a fully backup of all the data. Whether you will un understand or not, okay, I will explain thing first. See, whenever I will get the code from the server, I will not get only latest to code. I will get from the git to beginning. What are the code changes are there? Everything it will be bring it, it will be stored it. Everything it will be bring it, it will be stored it. Tomorrow this server will be down, no problem. Whenever server will be upright, I my local will have everything code. I will move the code into my server so that okay, it will not be a impact. It will not be a impact thing. Okay, next one. If remote server will be down for eh? one hour no problem developers will do the 
changes in local and move, move to and move to and move the move the changes to move the changes to move the changes to okay local repository okay move the changes to local repository it is called local repository never server will up never remote server will up then move the code from local server to remote server it will not impact i would say it is called local server local repo local server or local repo local server or local repo that's it okay team see every developer mission we have one is working copy it is local repository working copy local repository working copy local repository i will show you practically i will show you practically how this local copy how this okay remote copy would be there okay i will show you practically team okay don't worry okay don't worry anuj i will take care yeah no no okay svn will not get fully history akil svn will get if you observe only that latest file only you'll get svn will not gives fully history i have seen in my project svn always will give latest file changes only understand akil so okay svn will see from your local you are you are committing more code into a okay, svn server it will shows the history of the file but delete your local code you will try to freshly get the code from the your svn server to your local it will not give okay, history of the files it will give latest version files information only now here see the the advantage with this number one see even the server will be down no problem okay without impacting your developer productivity you can do all you can store into your local repo whenever it is ready then you can push into your okay remote repo okay so these these systems are collaboratively very well okay any one of the client repository can be copied back up to the server to the okay, repository every clone is a really fully backup of all the data team fully backup of all the data that means okay okay let's see it is a your okay remote server i will explain okay difference between okay svn and all okay i will explain it is a your okay, remote server server computer here you have a version database it will have three, three versions file one version file two version two Sorry. all are same file team please try to understand file 1 version 1 file 1 version 2 file 1 version 3 okay now if it is a okay, svn svn developer one Sir, practical perspective you will show only git or even svn you will touch a uh, practical I I will show you only Git SVN. No one will use. If you want, I can show you okay, SVN also. It's not a problem. But why we should waste our time? Okay? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I can show you. Okay, I have a hands on on both. I can show you. If okay. it is a okay, SVN team, it is Git. 
in okay, svn we have two okay, developers are there okay, developer one okay, developer two they are trying to okay, check out the code just i'm showing for your awareness okay trying to check out the file svn the terminology is called okay, check out Right. Never you will check out, you will get only version 3. Never you will check out, you will get only version 3. That's it. Always only in latest um, file on the version only will get. On top of latest file, you can add any more, then you can see okay history. But while getting the code from okay, while okay, here okay, developer one, here okay, developer two, while getting the code from okay SVN. Okay, from your remote to your local, always it will give, always it will give latest to version only. Always okay, it will give latest to version only. Okay, now it will see git here. It is giving git. Now if you go for git, how it is happened? See if you go for git team. Yes, simple one is. The super advantage with the git is, see here, as it is team. Simple advantage with the git is, as it is, it's not a remote server. It is a file. It is a file. Okay. Now here, the developer one and developer two. At any point of time. If you are trying to clone, if you are trying to clone, it's not check out. Here is a different. No, here clone. Clone file. Here clone. At any time, see whenever you are trying to clone a project, whenever you are trying to clone a project, whenever you are trying to clone a project now here what happened so complete history of your server will be come to your developer permission so that tomorrow this will be down no problem if it is git right you can move away and complete code into your git to whereas in okay svn if if it is down so now here what can you do you don't have complete project history. You have only that file, only that version, only you have it. That is the advantage of your okay, SVN and Git. So, what happened? You are Git. So, if your server goes down, you can move these changes into your later also. You can, no problem, number one. Number two. You can development, you can do it into your local repository whenever it is up, up, then you can move into your server. Understand, sir? Hope you are clear, sir. What is the git? Now tell me, okay. Okay, which one is good, sir? Okay, the distributed is good or, or okay, okay, centralized is okay, good, sir. Okay, please tell me okay, which one is good. Distributed is good. Yes, okay. Okay, distributed is the okay good one team. Okay, now we'll see. So this is what our first agenda team. So what is a version control? How many types of okay version control is there? Each version control, what are the advantage and drawbacks team? So Git will follow the okay, distributed okay version control system team so that so there are so many okay so many okay, advantages would be there so here whenever you are you are remote server will be down still you can collaborate with the local repo number two okay, okay number two now here what happened every time it is a fully copy of the history of the you know source code will be cloned into your local repo tomorrow your remote repo will be done your local repo should be replaced with your remote repository next one is very 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 important thing git software installations 
सर वन वन क्वेश्चन सर या प्लीज uh sir you said uh, uh, i mean uh, in the distributed version control system uh, we we are maintaining i mean every developer maintaining one local repository right i mean it uh, contains all the files yeah. so that, that it be stored yeah. in our local hard disk right am i correct yes 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 uh, yes okay. okay okay sir so for that uh, uh, so every day uh, i need to update uh, from the central repository or it will automatically update it no depends if you are if you need okay every day you should update every day if you need weekly once twice you should do okay update how to update okay, like, how to verify i have all these commands we'll we'll discuss okay okay sir thank you yeah tell me that's it that's it sir yeah okay thanks